What's up everyone, it's Tech Trooper 64 and today is February 11th, 2016. And today we're going to be talking about an announcement that Activision and Bungie made today about the future of the Destiny franchise. Ahead of its quarterly earnings today, Activision has revealed the future of Destiny, which will see a major expansion this year and a sequel in 2017. Activision Pub Publishing, along with its partners at Bungie, expects to bring a large expansion to Destiny in 2016 and to release the full game sequel in 2017. The investor uh, publishing note reads, Activision also has stated that 25 million players have logged more than 3 billion hours in Destiny. Not just that, but last month, a report asserted that Destiny's sequel was delayed out of 2016 and into the next year. And Destiny currently has a Valentine's Day event going on right now. You can read more on the Destiny sequel and Destiny's a large expansion coming this year in the description below with a link I'll give out. So, here's my thoughts on this. I'm a huge, huge fan of the game Destiny. I played a lot on it on Xbox One. I actually got the PS4 version recently, um, and I love it. I love it to death. I love Destiny a lot, and I do plan to, on doing a Let's Play of Destiny because I just love it so much. Um, it brings a lot of happiness to my heart that there is the large expansion coming. Um, and what's funny is that before... Not too long ago, Destiny, Bungie, uh, there was a rumor saying that Bungie was planning, instead of a big, another big expansion, such as the Taken King, to come for Destiny, they were going to work on the sequel. Now, as it says in the article here, it says, Last month, a report has asserted that Destiny's sequel was delayed out of 2016 and into this next year. This implies that the Destiny... Um, uh, sequel that was supposed to come this year was delayed and therefore because Bungie didn't want people to feel empty out of content of the Destiny franchise they want to add another expansion that they weren't expecting so that's great that we're going to see another um, Destiny expansion I love the Taken King I personally think it's unnecessary to buy it so for all of you who own Destiny and you're kind of hesitating to buy the Taken King unless you want the campaign, like, in a nutshell, unless you want the campaign, all the enemies, all the items, all the stuff that are exclusive to the Taken King, or so-called exclusive, you can find them in the main game of Destiny if you update your game. That's all you have to do. And it's not like, you know, oh, if you have an internet connection, the whole game is internet connection based. So if you have the game, you have internet. So, you know, just go update your game. And Destiny of the Taken King, all the enemies, all the items will be there. The only thing you're missing out on is pretty much the campaign. And that's really a choice of your guys. If you are okay with missing the campaign, that's fine. Then stay with Destiny. Because honestly, you're not missing anything. But um, because people usually put their consoles on auto-update all the time, your game is probably already updated and you already have all the Taken King stuff. But anyway... So what do you guys think about this news that a Destiny large expansion, another one, just like the Taken King, is coming again? Or would you prefer a Destiny sequel this year? What do you think about that? Make sure to let me know in the comments down below. And don't forget to rate, comment, favorite, and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.